Deadly stabbing early this morning in Manhattan. A 22-year-old man was fatally stabbed in front of his girlfriend. CBS News' Magdalena Doris joins us live from the Upper East Side, where police have a person in custody this noon. Magdalena? That's right, Chris. New developments right now. Police have a person in custody, as you mentioned. That person is a co-worker of the victim's girlfriend. Police do not believe that this attack was random. Detectives spent the morning searching under cars and in bushes for the murder weapon, even climbing construction scaffolding. That just told us they can't, we can't get a job site right now. They're looking for a knife. A knife used to murder 22 year old Javier Olivares at 1 15 this morning. Police say Olivares, who was from the Bronx, was walking up 3rd Avenue between 94th and 95th Street with his 20 year old girlfriend after work. They were approached by the male suspect, who police believe may have known the couple. A loud argument and physical violence. Fight between the two men broke out. According to the NYPD, during the altercation, Olivares was stabbed multiple times in the chest. His girlfriend was not hurt and nothing was stolen. Investigators say the armed attacker then ran southbound down 3rd Avenue. The couple hailed a cab to Metropolitan Hospital, where the 22 year old man died this morning. Nancy Cabrero is the principal of PS 198 across the street from the scene. This morning's murder investigation, too close for comfort. I have fifth graders and fourth graders that are coming to school by themselves, and they should be able to feel safe walking to their community school. Now, police say that the victim and his girlfriend had a two year old baby together. Again, police have a person in custody. That person works with the victim's girlfriend. Live on the Upper East Side, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News.